I wanted to come and just share with you and just to let you know that I know an airplane is not coming through right now. Why every time I come to sit down and talk to you guys, everything wants to be happening. Like God is our father, okay? When we are having a moment, he wants us to run to him, not run away from him or put on this front like we have it all together because we don't have it all together. Nobody has it all together. The person who thinks they are holier than holy, nobody has it all together and we all need to call on him, okay? smash the subscribe button, ring that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we upload a video. Happy Friday and welcome back to Friday Mommy Moment. And no, you don't have to be a mommy to enjoy this moment. All you need is a moment. And I'm sure if everybody's in shelter in place, locked down, doing their quarantine, we all should have a moment, shall we? Okay, so step on in here. Step on in. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Whew. Well, with all that being said, the first thing that we do on Fridays is... Friday shout out and today I want to give a shout out to two people okay it's two people because they come like in a pack like okay once I say it you'll understand it all right so I have we have been on this journey with YouTube for a little over a year now okay we hit a year in December I have met some amazing people through this journey on YouTube that has truly blessed my heart it's so many I can't even name them all however I do want to recognize two women who have become just a part of my daily life who is taking time to get to know me and I have taken time to get to know them and their family and you guys we do life together the two people I'm talking about is fun with the girls Brie and Taylor Made TV you guys go check them out that's Sheila so I will list their channels on here but we have been in a group tech since we've started this group test it's been months you guys I mean months all right and these two people we all as three, we call ourselves the Golden Girls, but we're not the Golden Girls. So Danzy, my husband, he named us Gold Divas. That's us. <laughs> um, because we're chocolate girls, you know, but we love the Golden Girls. We're always talking about um, the Golden Girls. I am, who am I? I'm Blanche. They, say, they said that I'm Blanche. Sheila is Dorothy. And Bree, she's Rose and Sophia. Mm -hmm. I want to give them a shout out because girls, ladies, I want to say that through all the mishaps that take place in my life and everything that I have been through, which you guys know that I share with you. Um, thank you so much for doing life with me. When it comes to my personal life, my mother, my family, my marriage, my spiritual walk with Christ, um, thank you so much for making me a part of your life and thank you so much for wanting to be a part of, for wanting to be a part of. Sorry, y'all know that's Isabella though, right? And thank you so much for wanting to be a part of my life. I truly, truly do not take you guys for granted. I love you so very much. And it's just so crazy how God put it together. And I don't question it. Like there's, you know, when you just know that God did something. And that's how I feel about you, Bree. And that's how I feel about you, Sheila. And um, to be myself and to be yourself. For us too, we don't get along with everything. Like we don't always agree on everything. But you guys, we just mesh. And I'm thankful I'm so thankful for that and I don't want a day to go by or life to pass by where I don't acknowledge that the people that are in my life who take time to be with me and that's my my own personal you know what I'm saying so my shout out today is going to Brie and Sheila but with the girls and Taylor Made TV you guys I love you so very very much and thanks for going through this quarantine with me thanks for doing life with me before this quarantine y'all and we gonna make it past this all right I did too much talking. Let's jump into this Friday mommy moment. You guys already know I got my coffee and my point blank period bug. Period. Doing too much? Y'all go ahead and grab your snacks, whatever y'all need, your beverage, your quarantine snacks, your quarantine beverages. Let's get into what I want to share with you today. Yeah. Okay, y'all. Y'all there? Y'all, this mommy moment almost did not happen. Period. Um, I'm glad that God was able to 
give me the strength to push through and still put this Friday mommy moment out. And I'm going to share not what I thought I was going to share about, but just being in a moment. And everybody is having moments. But I want to let you know, please know, because you don't deal with your moments like everyone else, it does not mean that something is wrong with you. Because you have moments of fear, it does not mean you don't have faith, okay? Because you doubt, you know, there was people in the Bible that doubt. There was people in the Bible who was fearful. There was people in the Bible who made a lot of mistakes and did a lot of things. And God did not be like, oh, your faith isn't where it should be. Or, oh, you must not be walking with Christ because you... No, no, no. And I understand, you know, people can joke about that or... Or people could take it literally but let me tell you something in your moment of fear and despair and your loneliness and your doubt and your mistakes that is when you are to draw to God more that is where he wants to meet you at instead of allowing the world to make you feel like you are just oh you don't your, your, your walk isn't this or your relationship isn't that don't listen to that like don't listen to that i see so many things on social media you know memes memes whatever however you want to say it and you guys that is not true that is not true you are allowed to have a moment and still be a good grace with god like god is our father okay when we are having a moment he wants us to run to him not run away from him or put on this front like we have it all together because we don't have it all together nobody has it all together the person who thinks they are holier than holy know all the bible scriptures front and back whatever up and down nobody has it all together and we all need to call on him he wants you to call on him he's not like oh wait a minute here you go down again don't knock on my door no he doesn't do that that's not what he's about and this mommy moment didn't happen because so many things took place my mom had a really trying time and scared me to life um thank god my husband was home and he was there to help me through that and um she's doing much better right now the kids all over the place it's like so many things happening you just gotta be like <sighs> but you are allowed to talk to God about whatever it is that you want to talk to him about whether it's doubt whether it's fear whether it's petty whatever it is he wants you to take it to him first he wants you to take it to him first before other people you know he wants to hear about your day no matter how petty you're being no matter how stubborn no matter how bad you have fallen no matter what it is even if it's the same thing he knows what you're going through don't ever feel or make someone make you feel that your relationship with Christ or God is not where it needs to be because you have a moment because that is false so I wanted to take this moment in my moment because trust me when these cameras go off I'm going back to that moment like today's just been a really crazy day um, everybody's alive and well thank you Jesus but it's just been like really busy it's been like dealing with one thing after the other and I'm sure it's going to cease in Jesus name and I still have my joy, I still have my peace, but it's been one of them days, okay? So I wanted to come and just share with you and just to let you know that I know an airplane is not coming through right now. Why every time I come to sit down and talk to you guys, everything wants to be happening? I don't know what they're doing. They must be doing circles, but we're going to get through this. Uh-huh. Not today, Satan. Not today, because they're going to get this message. They're going to get this message. I wanted to come to you to let you know, no matter what moment or stage or phase that you are in your life, it is nothing that can separate you from the love of God, okay? There's nothing that you can do to separate you from the love of Jesus Christ. He has the grace, he has the mercy, and he is waiting to hear from you. Please don't ever think that you are too far out there or too far in a moment where God's grace and love cannot reach you. Thank you so much for joining me with another Friday Mommy Moment. I appreciate you guys so much. If you're still here, go ahead and smash that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, so you can be notified whenever we upload a video. Until next time, stay blessed, stay true, and continue to be you because the world needs more people just like you. And we're going to act like we didn't hear that car drive by because it did, and we're just going to keep on going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> and if you're not feeling needed, remember here on the Soren Seaweed Family Channel, you are needed. Peace out, great people. Drop me a comment down below and let me know how you doing.